I keep on getting like new emails, but I don't know how to even read them. <sighs> well, we defended our oh, area against the British. I beg they will accept my most cordial thanks for this distinguished testimony of their approbation. But lest some unlucky event should happen, unfavorable to my reputation, I beg it may be remembered by every gentleman in the room that I, this day, declare with utmost sincerity, I do not think myself equal to the command I am honored with. Truly, there As is no pay, man better suited sir, I to the task. To really? The Congress I can no think of several. Charles Lee. This arduous employment do I know you? I mean, you do. I expect you to remember. I Come, Connor. There's someone I want you to meet. I will keep an exact account of my expenses. I'm sorry to pull you away Those like that, I doubt but not, they the will last thing we need is that the is two of you coming to blows. Now, Connor, allow me to introduce you to our newly appointed Commander-in-Chief. George Washington. Ah. ah. So you're the one who saved Sam and John at Lexington. It was the Patriots who did that. I merely lent support. <laughs> as humble as he is brave, we could use more men like you. I'm sorry, but if you'll excuse me, I should attend to Charles over there. He looks none too happy about being passed over for command. It was good to meet you, Connor. No problem. We shall meet again in the future. Tell me you have news of Pitcairn. I'm told he's taken shelter in Boston, where he's guarded by a thousand redcoats. The only way you're gonna get at him is if we draw him out. And lucky for you, we're launching an offensive against the city in order to do just that. Israel Putnam has been given command of our forces. Not Present bad. this to him and he'll provide whatever aid you require. You'll find him at the encampment on Bunker Hill. You have my thanks. No nice. need. It's the least I could do. Pitcairn's a dangerous man. The sooner we're rid of him, the better. I would say the same of Charles Lee. Now that's an altogether different beast. Let us leave it for another day. Best you head to Boston, Connor. Yeah. For the meantime... Well, let's get out of here. Let's go to Boston. Kill this bastard. Then... Kill some more bastards and then kill the bastard of my father. In this game, anyway. Right, can I... Whoops. No, I can't. Oh, well, fair enough. Don't look too far, anyway. It's quite a big drop, but don't climb. We want you to descend. There we go. Okay, it's across a large body of water. Oh dear. Right. Well. Might as well climb to the top of that massive tree and then do the viewpoint and then do the mission. Just have a gander of what's actually around here. I am glad about the implementation of actually, like, mapping. doing the map as you run around instead of, like, in previous games where you you had to basically see a viewpoint in order to actually um, like see what's around you but this is like an entirely different game compared to um, the previous one games because there's no like blacksmith there's no medicine people there's just no one. Well, 
No. Climbing a tree. Just casually, and hopefully we can get to the top of it. There we go. Uh, which way? How is that even possible? Am I you just... Yeah, I'm going downwards. Don't want to go downwards. Stop swinging! Fine. Um... That... No, we'll just go over here. Ouch. That wasn't supposed to happen. Right, climb the tree. Come on. Thank you. bit close. Right. Now we have to climb that, then... Go up that. Then go up here. Up here. I can't see. <sighs> Grab something. Fuck. Oh dear. How do you get onto the top of this tree? Move inwards a bit and then. Whoops. Go over there. Do we climb up? There we go. Synchronize. This is a bit of a strange one to do, but. Yeah, definitely a strange one. Oh, well, that's about five minutes wasted. Um. My business is to. Help? I'm looking for Israel Putnam. On whose orders? Samuel Adams. Follow me. Okay. Well, hopefully, the next few assassinations actually become a lot quicker than what they usually are. This is not Bunker Hill. Aye, it's Breeze. There's been some disagreement as to where we should encamp. Any news from Boston? The Tories aren't moving. And any time we try to press them, we lose a dozen men. I think Putnam and the others plan to assemble artillery on these hills. A good shelling might make the Red Coast rethink their strategy. And what of yeah. John Pitcairn? That bastard's the cagiest of the bunch. He's appeared time to time to taunt us or send regards by way of cannon fire. It's all right, though. He'll have what's coming to him soon enough. Good. That should he go faster? Oh, I remember. That's where we were here before. Okay. Putting him just up ahead. You can't. 
Yes, whatever. Oh dear. <laughs> oh wow. General Putnam. What? I'm looking for John Pickard. I was told you would be able to help me find him. He stuck away inside that city with no reason to leave. As long as that ship continues, it's assault. <laughs> Never flush him out. But if the ship was silenced, well, that poor guy might be forced to get off his arse and come forward. I shall fly this flag to signal my success. And I shall speak fondly of you at your funeral. Okay. Well, let's do this then. Of course, without taking any damage. Oh, this should be fun. Now to write EVD skill number two. Jump over that quickly. Stay in motion to avoid being hit by incoming cannibals. Oh yeah, this is just fun. Wow. This is what I actually came to get Assassin's Creed for. Wow, this is awesome. How well I'm actually surviving this is impossible, but... Hey, I'll take it, and I'm just gonna run past all these big coats. Excuse me. And jump. Okay, I have to get... Uh, assassinate a grenadier, remain undetected whilst on ships. Seems legit. The England flag with the Great Britain flag in there. I've never actually seen that before. Restricted area. Climb. I need a climb. Is there no way to climb on this thing? Oh wait. Shit, shit. Ah, fuck. I'll climb up the centre a bit then. Okay. Yep, you can. Oh, shit. Go off. What have I done? Come on. Can't see. Dismantle you. What the? Did you see the body? Nicely done. So, in conclusion, so far, glitches and weird experiences that have happened on this game so far. We've had. Connor running through a or walking through a um convoy. We've had bodies flying up. What can we have next? Let's kick you overboard. Plant bombs. And then we head over to the other ship. Restricted area, and he's already spotted me. Okay, up this. Just climb on a cannon, make sure not to shoot me. Let's do that.
Oh, wow. Okay. Go on. Go down. And I just... Yeah, you can lie like that. Climb on. Now what do we do? Okay. So that goes green. And climb the mast and replace the flag. Fair enough. Why is it? There we go. And then we go across the middle, and we can't do that at the moment. <sighs> that was close. Um. No. So we climb that, move it around, and then in the middle, and then just go up. Okay. Do we have to do it for both of these, or do we have to only do it for one and it automatically does for the other? We'll find out in a minute then. Oh. Okay. Interact. The United States flag. Oh, we did it. Nice. Impressive fall. Sequence seven complete. Or mission complete. Did we just fall back into the water or something? 